is the Prusik 41 3D printer. And this is a magic trick. But not the one you think. I'm gonna be honest with you, I'm a little frustrated. Prusa has been a giant in the 3D printing space for over a decade. And since the beginning, they've heard people say they aren't as polished as other brands, or they are an Apple. And they assured me they're not trying to be anybody else but Prusa. You see, every 3D printer on Earth is usually filmed in perfect conditions, but in my experience, only underwhelming products need shiny ads. 3D printing is only really about precision, reliability, and delivering results no matter what. That's why we're waging war on over-polished ads. And as you'll see later on in this video, <laughs> this is just the beginning. You see, instead of spending money on lighting and a studio and a camera person and ads, Prusa goes through crazy lengths to make sure they also deliver on their quality and reliability promise no matter what. So to prove that, I want to put these printers head to head. A control core one whose only job is to sit in my kitchen, look pretty, and produce great prints over and over and over. And next to it will be some printers that we subject to some stress tests to show off the Core One's relentless durability and reliability. And after torturing each printer, we'll send the same file to both of the Core Ones using EasyPrint and hopefully see the exact same results. A 98% perfect part output no matter what, AKA the Core One's magic trick. But how reliable is reliable? Test one, workshop mistakes. We've all been there. You get home and unbox your new Crusa printer only to realize you've put it on your loose airbag. <laughs> Silly me. Even a brief and violent trip to space doesn't change our core one's consistency. That's a pass. Test two. I. I've personally lost lesser 3D printers in a move, but what about the core one? One printer, one rental truck, one premium insurance add-on, and a bunch of everyday normal household items you might have the next time that you move. Add in some spirited driving. Look both ways, excuse me. Couple hard brakes. Oh man, I really gotta get across town. Hard stop. And a turn. Are you okay? Our camera guy just got hit in the face with his camera. But even after that rough crosstown trip, Let's see if this prints. It prints exactly like our control. Literally no change in quality. And watching it back, we apparently didn't even clean the bed plate. Whatever, it was fine. Pass. I'm so sure of the Core One's consistency and reliability that I could throw it off a cliff and it would still print perfectly. Actually. Okay, so this sounds dramatic, but it was a simple test. Just load the printer and some friends in a car destined for the junkyard. That happens to have RC control of the steering and pedals. And hope your guess that the Core One will still print after this is correct. Which I'm medium sure of. Apparently, God loves Prusa the most. <laughs> Maybe it'll print. And if not, I'm gonna cut this. Time to see if I'm an idiot. And after fixing exactly nothing, it printed as if it was never thrown off a cliff at all. Which yes, in retrospect, seems like an unnecessary test, but now you know. And there you have it. Prusa doesn't need to compare themselves to other brands because they're the legendary brand of 3D printing. Prusa is Prusa. Also, with the Core One, you won't just be secure knowing your printer's safe in the workshop, but also secure online. Unlike other printer companies, Prusa has vowed to keep your designs private, keeping the files you print or design out of the hands of any bad actors. It'd be a shame to work hard on a design that had it being printed out somewhere else in the world without your permission. Premium printing, premium quality, and premium security all made in the EU and US. It's not magic, and it's not anybody else. It's Prusa.
This was supposed to be a new core one for this shot, but we destroyed all the ones that they sent us. So. Now available in Core One Plus and Core One L. Oh, they're definitely not gonna ask me to do this again.